and we're back at it again folks really quick right here at brooks landscape i want to give you an opportunity to see what's taking place and as you can see we're using this river rock design and the reason why i come up with the river rock design is it be is because it allows for you to deal with all the water that's coming in on your landscape so as you can see here this entire design that is existing has set here for a while we did not do this design but what we're doing now is a drainage solution on this design that's going to help this customer get a peace of mind now traditionally every time it rains there's a tremendous amount of water that was moving up against this crab orchard steps and so by coming in with the river rock along with the erosion control fabric there's no longer going to be water that's going to go into the bare dirt therefore it's not going to allow for it to look like it does over here where that dirt starts to wash away and so does the rocks by going with the larger size rocks that's the four to eight inch river rock if you guys live in tennessee i'm sure you got a lot of this but it says that by going with this type of rock you're going to be able to ensure that this area here never is deteriorated by the amount of erosion that typically would have encompass this area because the rock sediment guys is going to be able to suck up a tremendous amount of water now in addition to that we're going to come back with our beautiful decorative river uh, gravel and that gravel is going to go back into this landscape that decorative gravel is going to look amazing as it pops in contrast with this river rock now in addition to that you can see that we're going to keep that going all the way up here folks and it's going to create a border so that the water that was easily moving this way would no longer be able to do so but the most important thing about this landscape was the way we came up with this design and the reason why I wanted to come up with this design because I knew that there was a tremendous amount of water that was coming onto the customer's yard from the neighbor's yard that's right from the neighbor's yard all of the water that was moving in on this landscape was finding itself through this fence and so what I've done is I've created a mini dry creek bed that allows for us to have a catch basin that's going to take that water into a catch basin guys and it's going to allow for that water to be appropriated on the back side of the property so now it's going to go into a six inch corrugated piping system and it's going up under the fence and so this is something that the customer is never going to have to worry about but it is evident to why we are here because tremendously the water was affecting this landscape by being able to come through this fence area and then roll down these steps and now that's no longer going to happen we're also going to have this beautiful river rock design going all the way up as we get our erosion control fabric in here you'll see that that's going to come all the way up preventing any water from ever being able to move even when it's raining and then we're also going to come back on phase two and put in some sod but for today we're going to be putting in some wheat straw and a little bit of that bermuda and or what we like to call um, zoysia but it's going to be after we finish this completion of this job first dealing with the drainage so within about a week or two we're going to come back with either a tiff tough bermuda or zoysia um, we'll put a little bit of wheat straw down right now because we know we're coming back in about two weeks after we've been able to complete the first phase of this landscape and as you know guys landscaping is expensive but I tell you what if you're working with a professional we're going to give you a detailed line itemized quote and most importantly we're going to put you into a position to where you know what's going on with your landscape but as you can see this design was absolutely necessary because it dealt with all the water that was coming in on the landscape once and for all.